The national police is cracking down on a kind of phishing scheme that unscrupulous personalities are using to dupe would-be victims. Using a deceptive voice, scammers are able to steal valuable information and eventually even actual cash. What this racket is called, Luisa Erispe reveals in this report. Police data says there was a decrease in cyber crimes recorded. Online scams in January 2024 fell 24% compared to the same period last year. But the PNP ACG continues to take action on reported crimes in cyberspace, like in Noveleta Cavite, where a man was arrested due to an arrest warrant issued by a court in Tuguigarao, Cagayan, the third most wanted person in Region 2 for cases related to violation of anti cybercrime law. The suspect is also allegedly involved in voice phishing or vishing scam, in which he convinced his victim he was the bank representative and then later persuade her to give up her bank account's OTP or one-time PIN to cancel an allegedly unauthorized online purchase she made. The victim gave several OTPs before finding out that half a million pesos was stolen from her bank account. The PNP ACG said that vishing scam is being done through a phone call and the modus operandi of choice by suspects is to pose as bank customer service agents seeking to sway their victims to give up the OTPs to their bank accounts. Ito ay kukunin niya yung information mo. Diba? So kunwari, mm, meron kang acquired na oh, meron kang binining ganito, blah, blah, blah. Kung wari, kailangan mong i-refund, kailangan mong kukunin uli yung amount, yung mga ganon. Para po, may balik namin yung pera na yun, kailangan namin ng OTP. Kala mo, taga-bango talaga dahil manipulative yan eh. Kaya niyang gayahin. Currently, there are only a small number of vishing scam cases, but the PNP ACG is closely monitoring this particular scam. Itong vishing namin, nasa 200 to 300 plus lang yan eh. Pero yung amount na nakukuha nila ay napakalaki, bawat victim. Depende kung magkano yung laman na pera ng natawagan nila. Meron pa tayong mga biktima na umaabot ng isang milyon ng naubos na pera niya sa banko niya. Kaya sa ating mga kababayan, Ang bangko po, paulit-ulit po sinasabi ng ating bangko na hindi po sila tatawag kung kani-kanino gamit ang cellphone. At hindi rin po sila humihingi ng OTP. Luisa Erispe from the National TV for a new and better republic.